Hey there, this is a video on how to transform the homemade Transformers Rise of the Beast officially licensed Porsche product of Automot Autobot Mirage. So we showed the previous video how to transform from car to robot, and this is for robot to car. So first we're gonna take the weapon off. There is his weapon, put it on the side. And the easiest step to do is to take these fists here and rotate them out the way or they're actually supposed to rotate like this and this is completely optional you don't have to rotate these fists but this is just so the robot mode doesn't get any clearance issues and then you're going to collapse the arms like this so first step we're going to come to the back of the robot and then we're going to take the tabs where he has these shoulders right we're going to unpeg these tabs from the side car windows and then that will kind of loosen itself and then you fold that out and you can see this the side of the car do the same thing on the other side and we're going to come to the back of the um the robot unpeg this and then this will kind of loosen out and this is basically the back of the car you can leave that dangling on the side we'll deal with that later and we're going to unpeg this and kind of unfold this. And when you rotate it, you can see it is the front of the car. And then we're going to basically take this where these were actually holding the sides of the car and we're gonna fold that down. And then we're gonna peg in with these side cars here. So to peg in is to simply look right here you're gonna see the black indicator, and then you're going to tab this with that black indicator, like that. And that's basically, oh, I'm sorry, this one. So you're gonna tab this peg with this right here, like, so it holds at it. So if you rotate it on the other side, it's actually this guy that's gonna go in like this. And then same thing, take the, uh, side of the car and then you're going to tap in this with this little stapler joint where you, you saw my thumb and I probably have to do this off camera um, I think I'm going to have to do it off camera real quick and bam so that is tabbed in and then you're going to take these tabs right tab it in with these black indicators which you see right here um or these black lines there should have been indicators but uh, probably a factory error peg it in like that and you can see that it is creating the um car the front of the car Ooh, this tab is kind of there we go and then you're gonna fold that. You don't have to fold it, these tabs, but you know, kind of makes the car look clean. You don't want these sticking out. Um, makes it look like a clean car. Tag it in like that. You can see we got the front of the car a little bit. You can rotate this. And then we're gonna to come to the front of the robot. You can just leave this dangling up so you can see the head. And then you're going to take this red tab, lift it up like that. And that's basically going to um, separate, you know, the robot a little bit. And you can uh, rotate this like that. Make sure the arms are pushed in. And then the legs. Um, so we're going to take these legs, right? Rotate it back. And we're going to unpeg these. So you're going to rotate. Um, the figure where it's facing the back of the leg and then you're going to have it on top like that Do the same thing on the other side on top like this um, And Nothing much has changed, but it's actually loosened these so You can actually you know fold it up like that And then what you're basically going to do is um, Well, don't fold it up you can actually leave these down. So you're actually going to rotate the leg all the way. So 
toe where the bottom of this foot is sticking right there where his um, top is. So you do the same thing on the other side, rotate that leg like that. And then these will basically stick out where the wheels are. And if you rotate it, you can see that this is gonna go with that. So um, you're going to basically take this side and peg that in. You can see the peg right there. And then fold it so it secures it. Do the same thing on the other side. Bam, right there. You fold it with the black indicator. Fold it. And then you're going to take this, which if you remember, the head connects with the back of the car. So we're basically, this is where it was in the robot mode. You're gonna simply rotate that back to where it would go. And you kind of fold this. And then these indicators, these pegs, right, are gonna tab in with this wheel. And you can see the black indicator right there. Bam. And you do the same thing on the other side. And then fold it so it secures it. And then with this, you can kind of fold these so it won't like lay flat on car mode it would so you can gently kind of fold it and you can see we're almost there we just gotta simply simply push this which was the front of the car and then tab that in i hope you can see that tab this with this which was the back of the car top so push that in like that and um you don't have to fold it. And um, I don't know what's going on here. This is actually the leg, which should have stuck out. So just make sure that the robot legs here are sticking behind the, ro uh, the front of the robot so it doesn't get in the way. And then you kind of just want to um, let's see. Let me make sure I'm not missing a step. So just kind of like fixating on the car, just making sure that it looks pretty. You know, just f you can fold on these sides. Make sure the sides are folded properly and make sure this is tucked in as your wishes. Make sure this is tabbed in all the way. And as you can see, it is back to the Porsche car, all transformed. Um, and you can actually peg in the weapon You can actually peg this weapon on the top for weapon storage. Now it's not official, there's no peg, for, you know, black indicator, but since it can squeeze right there, you can actually have the gun, his gun, right like that. So that is From Robot to Car of Mirage from the new Transformers movie.